So today we're gonna learn about a spin move that will really help shorter players. And when I mean short, I mean anything uh, six feet and under. Six feet and under in basketball is pretty short and if you're going to the middle of the hole, you gotta have an aggressive move. So let's learn the aggressive spin move, all right? Now let's check out the aggressive spin move. This is what it looks like. If you're dribbling through the center, I'm using a medicine ball. That way it makes me that much stronger when I actually use a real basketball. Uh, this is a 15 pound medicine ball. Uh, it's gonna really help me develop strength because it gets really rough down there in the center. Inside the paint, you're gonna dribble in. When you, get, when you pick up your dribble, you have two steps. So, after you pick it up, you get your two steps. The first step is the left foot. This is the first step. When you spin, lean your, lean your backside into the fender, and then you get one more step. So take a big step with your right foot. It's gonna look like a traveling when you do it slow, but it's not. Remember, when you, do, when you pick up your dribble, you get two steps. So the first step is not your right foot. If you're spinning left, if you're spinning left when you're driving in, if you're spinning left, your first step is not gonna be the right foot. That's the right foot you're still dribbling. So when you pick it up, your first step is your left foot, right? And that's when you lean into them with your backside. Your second step is your right foot. It's almost like the European sidestep, but with a spin move. And if you can push your backside into the defender, while you're doing that spin move, you'll be very close and you won't have him in your way. Let's look at it again. One, two. The real trick on that is to put your backside into the defender when you take your first step. Practice that, spin move, and you'll get closer to the basket. It's really effective for the smaller guys.